What is going on guys, it's RealTouchGML here, back with another game maker tutorial. Today we are going to be continuing our series with the zombie game. So today, we are going to go ahead and code the zombies and spawners. Uh, last time we went ahead and just made our player move around and shoot, and you can look at that tutorial in the annotation in the top left. So what we're going to do now is code these zombies. So what I've done is I've created a, a sprite, kind of like a zombie looking thing. <coughs> And uh, yeah, let's go ahead and create some objects. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to create an OBJ zombie. And there we go. Just give it the sprite. And then we are going to, I am, I am going to create an OBJ spawner. Now we'll get a little more detailed into this in later tutorials, but right now we're just going to create uh, an OBJ spawner. So in this step event here, what we're going to say is if floor random, we'll say 20, is less than one instance create x comma y obj zombie so what this means is if floor so floor means it's gonna be a whole number so it's gotta be like five or eight or it can't be like some decimal point uh... it's gotta be a whole number so if floor random 20 so pretty much since we said 20 here it's gonna pick a number through 0 through 20 and if that number happens to be less than 1 it's going to create a zombie so every millisecond it's going through this so if you uh, increase this number you're gonna decrease the odds of a zombie spawning so if we go ahead and put this in the room we can actually put this in multiple places that's that's what's nice about it um, and as you can see there are some zombies that pop up now they didn't do anything yet because we have not coded them to do anything so what we're going to do is in the zombie event in the step event we're going to say image angle equals point direction x comma y comma obj player dot x and obj player dot y <coughs> and pretty much that's just going to have the zombie point towards our player. So now what we're going to do is we're going to say MP potential step OBJ player dot X and OBJ player dot Y and at a speed of three and then we're going to say false. So pretty much what MP potential step is it's just a more uh, fancier version of move, move towards point and pretty much this is just a little better pathing uh, so we have this last statement here uh, and that checks for solid objects so if there's a solid object in the way it'll kinda get around it uh, in order to get to your player and in order to put this on we would say true but right now we have a little problem that if our zombies spawn on top of each other they won't be able to move because you know they'll be trying to get around each other and they won't be able to so uh, that's why I have it on false right now but we will change that later so now if we go ahead and play it <coughs> uh, as you can see they are spawning and I did set the number a little high here <laughs> uh, yeah I set the number a little high so on the spawner so we can go to the spawner here and we'll set it to say 70 and that'll probably decrease our odds by a lot. <clears throat> still got some. Still got some. Uh, wow, still a lot spawning out. Now you see how they kind of. Uh, they kind of sometimes they spawn like right after another, like boom, boom, like if you just saw over there. Uh, we can actually fix this. <clears throat> so in the create event, we can say uh, spawn equals true. And in the step event, if it spawns, then we're going to set spawn to equal false. And we're going to set alarm 0 to equal, we'll say, eh, 60. Eh, we'll say 30. So no matter what happens, there's always going to be a second apart uh, where the zombies spawn. So we'd have to do and and spawn equals true. <coughs> so now an alarm 0. Just set spawn to equal true, and that fixes that. <clears throat> so now you'll never get that little, that little boom boom, 
of the spawning which is uh, a lot nicer and so yeah that's my tutorial for today go ahead and leave a like go ahead and subscribe next tutorial we will be going for uh, actually collisions with these with these zombies and getting in blood effects and stuff like that and uh, if you have not seen my bulletin lately uh, I did create a new gaming channel if you'd like to check that out uh, where we play Starcraft, Minecraft, Call of Duty, all that crap so <laughs> uh, go ahead and check that out the link will be in the description for that and I will see you guys next time